Welcome to this champ and brackets tutorial. I will now show you how to install champ, xamp, um, and also connect it to PHP my admin and install brackets and connect brackets to champ so that you can use the live preview when doing your PHP work. As we can see here, you click live preview and you will immediately see the changes taking place. So, let's start. So we begin by going to xampp.org to install Champ. Zamp. People say it differently, but you know, they say Champ. So, and then we pick for OS X because we're installing this on a Mac. And while waiting, we go to brackets.io. And we download brackets. Which is a very smooth text editor, yes. <laughs> so while we wait, I'm just gonna skip through this real quick. And there we go, it's done. So I will install brackets. We open it. And we just drag it over to that folder and uh, alajazam it is installed. This will take a bit longer on your PC because, well, your Mac, because I can skip in time. So now that brackets are installed, I will place it on the desktop menu because I want to have it there. like so let's take a look to see that it's actually working yes yes I want to open and it looks beautiful well almost beautiful I'm gonna make it a little bit more beautiful just because I wanna so I'm gonna go to view and themes and then change the theme to brackets dark and I'm gonna increase the font size to 15 because I'm sitting on a MacBook Air here we go so this is how I like it and then just quit it now let's go and install champ And just drag it over to install easy as pie and we're gonna skip in time again not gonna wait for that okay I'm just gonna move this a little bit first <laughs> now skip boom so close that and I'm gonna do the same with champ drag it down to the menu or whatever it's called down here because I want it there close this and open it delete that I don't want no clutter on my desktop yes open let it do what it has to do okay type in password go on so it's initializing stacks then simply click start oh well yeah we got services network volumes log now general click start <laughs> and this might take a while depending on your system so if you want to pay attention to what's going on you can go to log and here you will see 
what's happening as it is happening. Stack successfully started. Now let's start Apache and MySQL, SQL. ProFTPD is not necessary here. And here we can see that they have started. Don't bother with the network, but we will mount this so we can access the folders within Champ. So we're going to see here in the file finder, file manager, then click mount. And you will see this IP address server here. So go into lamp and the folder that is, which is important to use here is htdocs. This is where you will create the folders that you're going to be working on. So when you're working on, you know, a PHP project, for example, so I'm just going to create a PHP fun folder here. And brackets is so easy that to open the project folder, you simply find the project folder and you drag it in to the working files. And there you go. And it will automatically import all the files and folders within that folder. So I'm just going to create a first test.php file. We just echo some something so we can use that to check whether it works or not it's not going to work right away but you know i'm doing this now so are we connected to live preview and this as we will see we are not connected to live preview yet so we can click here all we want but it's not set up and you know localhost might work or might not work um i haven't actually got localhost to work on the mac only on pc and linux yeah and i, I wrote that wrong here we go but it's still not gonna work so you will need to use the ip address but we'll get to that First, go back to general and go to application here. If you get this screen, you know it works. It's connected. Now, check PHP My Admin and you will get this most likely access forbidden. So what you do then is you go back and then you go to how to guides and you go to enable remote access to PHP at My Admin. Here you can see the message. So just follow this, you will find the folder extra within etc, within lamp, and there you will find the file, which I cannot see right now, the httpd zamp something something dot conf file, yes. And then you will change what you see here. So go to its and then extra and find the httpd jamp.conf file. There we go. I already have genie installed so it naturally opens there. You do not need that to open it. So we will find the right code snippets. Allow override and change require local to require all granted. So go back and here we have it. So remove require local and paste in require all granted. And save.
Now you might go back to PHP my admin, but it will not work until you stop Champ and then restart it. So that's what I'm doing right now. And I'm just going to close that browser. Here we go. Now let's check those services. Enable MySQL and Apache. Now back to general and go to application. Now we can go to PHP my admin. And it works. We are in. Now let's connect live preview in brackets. First, I'm going to change the folder name to no capitals, no capital letters. I heard somewhere that it's important. So yeah, I just forgot when I created it. So let's see. I'm just going to import that once again so it updates and I'm gonna find the same folder that I'm using here after the IP address and here you see it. so when you see your files then just copy that address go into brackets then to file and project settings and here you will paste that address and now we will be able to open live preview Well, we should be able. So I'm just going to close the browser and let it open anew. So brackets requires Chrome for live preview. Now let's see. Click live preview once more. And here we go. Now if you want to check that it's actually working, then you can change the output and then control S to save and immediately as you save you will see it updates so now we know we are connected so that's it now you got brackets with live preview champ and PHP my admin and you're good to go so have a great day